Are you looking for a picture perfect spot to pick your own sunflowers? WBZ's Levin Reed takes us to a special garden in Wellesley. It's 1.3 acres of the stunning flower of the summer. The amazing thing about sunflowers is that they actually follow the sun. And so you can see at the moment it's still dark and cold mm -hmm. and they're drooping down. And as the sun comes up, they'll pop their heads up and then they'll twist and they'll follow the sun throughout the day. The Massachusetts Horticultural Society has unveiled their sunflower spectacular. It's a chance for people to come in and take it all in. And at the same time, pick a couple of sunflowers of your own. When you see people pick it with their little kids or, or you know, a date night or a date day, what what has it been like for you to watch it? It's been it's been really exciting. Um, we're this is really close to Boston. Um, there's not really been anything this close before, and so a lot of people are coming out of town um, who maybe have not had this experience before. Now there's more to this bright flower than meets the eye. What's really amazing about sunflower is that this what we think of as a flower is actually hundreds, maybe thousands of flowers. So there are there are two types of flower sure. making up what we call an inflorescence. And there's also more than one sunflower. This one you just told me about is a burgundy one. Yeah. So this one is um, this one is not yet fully out. Um, mm -hmm. So, uh, and the reason is this is so popular that as soon as they flower, they're picked and taken yeah. away. Um, so this isn't quite ready, but you can see in leaves even, the pigmentation is purple. So you show up here for the Sunflower Spectacular, but there is so much here for everyone to see, whether it be the Italian Italianate Garden or right here in Wheezy's Garden for Children. Mm. Smells like Cheerios. So this is uh, the formal garden that really goes with the mansion that's just ahead of us. Mm -hmm. um, and it would have been an entertaining space, a formal space for the family when that was originally occupied. Um, and it's a place where now we hold um, wedding ceremonies. It's what is this that we're looking at that goes, it looks like it's a, an outpoint? Um, that's the Twig Tower. Um, so that's one of the high points in the garden and kids will run up and down the steps and hang out in there like a little fort. Man, this is a place that's flowers, flowers and more flowers at the Massachusetts Horticultural Society. I'm Levin Reed, WBZ News. Absolutely beautiful spot.